Welcome to the Dean McGee Institute. I'm Mike Sikowski, the Residency Program Director. Our job in this residency is to help you find your best selves and to equip you to do great things in whatever venue you choose. That may be comprehensive ophthalmology, a fellowship trained specialty, private practice, academics, research, global ophthalmology, or organized medicine. Whatever it is, we have the people and the resources here to prepare you to succeed in whatever you do. But don't take my word for it. Please listen to my friends and colleagues here at Dean McGee who work together to create such a wonderful environment. Thank you for visiting. At Dean McGee, we treat everybody as family, and we have only one vision, vision for life. And this vision for life is to help people so that they can maintain their vision in life, they can enjoy their golden years. And we train residents so that they can be the best that they can be in their field. I chose Dean McGee Eye Institute because of its stellar reputation of training excellent ophthalmologists. We promote a culture here of residents who are hardworking, dedicated to the field of ophthalmology, and excellent team players. This is a patient-centered environment where our residents are taught by truly outstanding clinicians and surgeons who work with a sense of purpose and commitment to those patients in a state-of-the-art facility. One of the great things about Dean McGee is that you get first-hand experience both in the clinic and in the operating room almost as soon as you walk through the doors. I've been here at Dimigi for less than a month and I've already done retinal injections and YAG lasers. So we get quite a vast amount of experience very quickly and that helps you be more comfortable when you're on call or taking care of any patient that might walk through your door. If you take a quick look at the numbers, it's pretty clear that Dean McGee is in the upper echelons with regard to surgical volume. But what that volume doesn't really do is tell the full story about the experience from a surgical perspective as a resident. Over the last few years, we've really worked hard to establish a defined surgical curriculum so that there's a shared experience amongst all the residents. We are fortunate to have a whole host of different ophthalmologic subspecialties here at Dean McGee. So we really get to see, I think, the whole breadth of possible ophthalmic surgery. And we're fortunate to operate at the VA and Dean McGee Eye Institute Surgery Center across the street. Our attendings are not only interested in having us in the OR, but really interested in teaching us. Residents will spend time observing our refractive surgery service, performing the full spectrum of extramural laser surgery, PTK, corneal cross-linking, intacts, and other refractive and minor surgical procedures that we perform so that they're exposed really to the full spectrum of different anterior segment surgeries. When the residents come through, they should get uh, exposed to all aspects of what oculoplastic surgery has, number one. And then number two, not necessarily that they're going to be doing lots of plastic surgery cosmetically around the eyes, but to know what the approaches are and the potential complications that there can be so that they know what to do when a patient walks in the door with those complaints or issues. A lot of the residents are super excited about their ability to experience minimally invasive glaucoma surgery, which we call MIG surgery. The glaucoma rotation, which you start in your second year, you'll have the ability to experience a full ab internal canaloplasty, more than likely, on your own as primary, eye stent inject placement, hydrus placement. So the MIGS numbers here are paralleled to some of the formal glaucoma fellowship numbers. Residents may graduate with 30, 40, 50 primary MIGS procedures by the time they're finished. One of the biggest strengths of our program is that we get a lot of cataract surgery, probably one of the highest in the country for cataract surgery, but we also get to do a lot of oculoplastic surgery, strabismus, minimally invasive glaucoma surgery, and the majority of our surgical experience is done right here at our very own ambulatory surgery center. I think the D. McGee Resident Clinic experience is really fantastic. 
I've been really impressed with the resident's skills and their ability to take care of really advanced ocular disease just in managing the scope of ocular disease that, that comes through the resident clinic. And then of course there's all of the surgical experience and training that comes from that patient population and the residents just get a, a great depth and breadth of, of surgical cases and diversity of surgical procedures. We obviously are affiliated with the University of Oklahoma, which is a level one trauma center. I think as a resident, one of the reasons that that's a really good thing for us is because we get such a broad variety of pathology. Being the major level one trauma center for the state, we get patients from all over with all sorts of injuries and they're all primarily managed by the residents uh, with backup as appropriate. Our clinic is an excellently run clinic and we see a ton of patients throughout the day. So we're seeing things from routine esotropia, vision checks, to things that are super rare that sometimes you don't even find near BCSC and we really have to do research. And that's why it becomes really important to have such a strong resident team and a resident relationship. We're always thinking about how we can make you guys better. So even on call, all of us are approachable. Really, you're operating pretty independently. You always have the support from the faculty, and that's one of the areas that I found to be the most gratifying, is that you are the patient's doctor, but you do have the support system between your senior resident, the fellows, and then your attendings. Education, especially resident education, has always been a high priority here at Dean McGee, and it really is embedded into the fabric of our organization. I think one of the unique things about our training program is we can offer residents training in eye pathology. I interact with residents, teaching them how to gross eye specimens, gross globes, and to look at specimens under the microscope. Eye pathology is pretty foundational for pretty much any area of the eye or any subspecialty. It's pretty amazing what we offer. In addition to just kind of the normal series that we go through that covers everything in the BCSC, we also have seven or eight times a year a visiting professor come. And these are leaders in ophthalmology from all over the country. We have the Resident Alumni Day where we all get together once a year and present research and just different things that are going on in the ophthalmology community. I've had a lot of positive experiences here. First and foremost, I think you can think about the networking events and the conferences we got to go to. Every year we can go to the American Academy annual meeting as well as the AAO Mid Forum. In addition to that, if you have any projects or research paper to present, you can submit it to a national or state level and you always get to go. The program will pay for your traveling fees and also you get time off to go there. In addition to clinical, surgical, and educational programs, I would emphasize that we also have some of the top vision research programs in the country. Basic and translational research at Dean McGee extends from the front of the eye to the back of the eye and all points in between. The Department of Ophthalmology for many years has been among the highest ranked departments on campus and it is among the top 20 NIH ranked research programs in the country. They're very collaborative, very available, and even in my case, in my first year, I had the opportunity to start a research project in a lab, and I've had easy access to the lab and a lot of support. Almost everywhere you look, there's somebody looking for collaboration, for bright, new, fresh minds to help on emerging projects. They're very interested in directly benefiting patients. There's also great precedent for very basic science here, and so the opportunities are immense and I think endless. If you take a look at where our recent graduates have gone, you'll see that there's a wide variety of places. Some have gone on to really nice fellowships with well-known people across the country, but many people have gone into comprehensive care. And I think that the reason many people do that is they feel very well trained leaving Dean McGee. Transitioning from residency is challenging for anybody, especially when you transition from an academic to a private practice. However, the training at Dean McGee made me feel so comfortable in private practice that the transition for me was very smooth. There wasn't a clinical or surgical situation that I didn't feel comfortable handling, given the support and training that I got at Dean McGee. 
When one comes to the Dean McGee Institute, one also comes to Oklahoma City, which is now one of the 25 largest cities in the country. I'm originally from Los Angeles, California, so this is my first stint outside of my hometown, and believe it or not, I actually really, really enjoy it. Oklahoma City is what I thought was going to be a small town, actually a really big city. Lots of new restaurants to go to, lots of cool things to do. I feel so lucky that our residency is located in Oklahoma City. It's a city filled with culture, excellent food, a world-class basketball organization, and really patients who really appreciate the excellent eye care you give. I think organizations often come down to culture, and I think here the fundamental part of our culture is related to leadership and service. All the third years get to go on an international trip that's completely paid for. Not only do we get to go over and be there with our own faculty members, but we also get to help in training residents and other trainees who are over there. In the future, my husband and I hope to actually go overseas. We'd like to start up residency programs. I came to Dean McGee because when I mentioned that, there was a lot of excitement behind that. And I could tell that people here were going to be supportive of that dream. The attendings, whenever we have had our first few lectures, they took the time to ask us about our families, about where we were living, where we were coming from, and so that helped me feel like I really made the right choice in coming here. I felt that I'd have faculty and staff who genuinely cared about my development, not only as a physician, as an ophthalmologist, but also as a person as well. All the residents really come together as a family. If we finish clinic early, we always help each other out. The culture here is awesome. It's one that's full of camaraderie. All the residents are super helpful, whether it's you know on call or covering for each other on clinic and even outside of work. There's a group of us that always will hang out. This is the time to kind of like make some of your best friends that'll be with you like even after your residency. We are lucky to have great uh, ancillary and support staff here at Dean McGee. These people work tirelessly to help us book cases and contact patients. Come here, see how you like it. It is a perpetual learning environment. I'm available to help you guys with any of the needs you might have. I will be taking care of you this whole time. This place is great. The fact that all of the different hospitals are on one hill makes it incredibly easy to move back and forth between the Children's Hospital, the Veterans Administration Hospital, and OU, as well as the Dean McGee Institute is right across the street. Sometimes multiple emergencies happen at multiple places at once, and instead of having to drive across the city, everything is right there. The other nice thing about it is that we can meet up for lunch really easily, despite being at various locations around campus. Ultimately, it comes down to the people our residents, our fellows, our faculty, and our staff who make this a special place. Now that you've heard from our great residents and faculty and staff, I'm sure you'll agree that Dean McGee is a great place to work. Thank you again for visiting us and welcome to the Dean McGee family.